I knew it. It's exactly the same. Nothing's changed at all. So that's... the Song of Nephilim. Dr. Mizrahi's... Milsha's... Help me, Junior! Momo! Momo's inside that thing! Are you certain? Scanners! 100 series observational unit prototype Momo, tracked and located. She's in the middle of the distortion, caused by the phase transfer. Momo? What's she doing in there? Damn it! It's him! Albedo! I felt his presence the moment I heard Momo's voice. Ah, Albedo. That explains what that unsettling feeling was about. Not to mention why she's there. What do you mean? That girl, Momo. Not only is she a specialized realian, but also the repository for the late Joachim Mizrahi's records. Albedo and the UTIC organization want that information. They've wanted it for a long time. Albedo? Who's that? My dark half. The part I've tried to hide away. Dark half? Junior, get this ship closer to the Song of Nephilim. What? It isn't necessary to get too close. Just lend me a shuttle, that'll be enough. Hold it! Where do you think you're going? I'm going to save Momo, no matter what. Don't bother. What did you say? When someone close to you is in danger, you lose your objectivity. And it almost always ends in tragedy. I've seen it happen too often. Oh what, so I'm just like them now? Aren't you? This albedo person. When you finally confront him, do you think you can keep your head straight? <sighs> if you can honestly say yes, that's all I have to say. But if you can't... You're really something, you know that? You think you're such a hardened soldier compared to me. Tell me then, how can I become cold and detached like you? Only allow yourself to think of numbers and battle strategy. Don't let your mind wander to the faces or voices of those precious to you. Even when it seems cruel not to. Too intense of an interference will overwhelm and ruin everything. That's what I've learned over these past hundred years. The day numbers and battle strategies replace people, it'll be game over, cyborg. Junior, remember to stay focused. No matter what he does to Momo, only by doing so will you be able to save her. Listen to my advice. I know what you're going through. to the side where we can dock. All right. Bring us in, Tony. Be careful. Roger. Closing in and approaching the... Wait! Huh? Tony, can you show me the top? What? You want me to go around the top? Please, just circle around the top. All right. But once around is all you're getting. Who knows what's up there? Thank you. That's it. That's... the place I saw. 
through the hospital window. I'm gonna make him pay for this! Hold on, Momo. I'll make you whole again. Junior! What happened to Momo? That monster Albedo's gone and reversed the spiritual link. Reverse the spiritual link? It's the opposite of what Guinan and I do when we communicate telepathically. But by seizing someone's consciousness, you can delve deep inside the other person's mind and drag out whatever memories you feel like taking. You can't be serious. That means Momo's mind is... Yeah. It's best for you all to go back. I'll handle this on my own. Wait! It's too dangerous to go alone. Sorry. This is between me and him. All right? But still... Momo... You... wanna come with me? I'm going to... Shion... Don't you remember what you told me? This song... It's responsible for destroying Milsha and bringing the Gnosis into this world. If this has anything to do with that place that I know of... Then... This involves me as well. Albedo! You... Please spare me from any trite lines like, You're still alive? Life and death are merely empty words lacking any power over me. By the way, did you ever bother telling the girl? Does she know that we're monsters, both you and I? Uh, uh, Momo! Uh. <laughs> I want the me that's inside you. Momo! Momo! That's not her. That's... Free from the bonds of flesh. A pure consciousness has no true form. All that exists is the longing for reality. Did you see that, Mapesh? Your witness to his true nature right now. A consciousness desperately struggling to stay alive. Such a pitiful sight. This is unseemly, Rubido. Junior? Uh. Albedo! Get your stinking hands off of her! Rosa! Hmm. You'll do something. If I do this... You mother! <laughs> what pain! So sweet, so alive. Pain is such a vital part of realizing one's existence. Try to remember, Rubido. What it takes. What you must do. Or... Have you lived in peace for so long that you've completely forgotten? I don't give a damn about what you have to say! Just give her back! 
I don't think so. I'll just take what I want and proceed with my plans. And along the way, I'll make you remember who you really are. <laughs> Shut up! I don't need some freak contaminated by Udu to tell me! Junior? Contaminated? Not quite. More like evolved. I experienced but a fragment of my true power that day. The waves that inundated my body are now a part of me. I've reached a higher stage of existence compared to you incomplete mortals. I am the Alpha and the Omega of perfect consciousness. Stop it! <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is nice. Don't you want to give it a try? <laughs> Mama! Impossible. Is that nanotechnology? No. Nano machines can't work anywhere near that fast. And besides, not even the research laboratories have models with head-regenerating capabilities yet. He's a URTV. Just like Junior. What? URTVs. They were created for the express purpose of eradicating Udu. Udu? Rubido. You still don't remember? Or could it be... Fear? You're frightened, is that it? Am I right? I can't blame you. The only thing that matters to you is yourself. Rubido. So cruel. And yet this girl clings to you so dearly. Isn't it pitiful? One more layer. Just one more layer. And then I'll have everything inside of her. I'm sure you know what that means, Rubido. Now then, I wonder how much more she can take. This is the extent of my power. Nobody can stop the events that are about to unfold. All I can do is delay the inevitable for just a while longer. But at the least, I can entrust this to you. The events are starting to come together. Soon you will meet them. So until then, so that's... Joachim Mizrahi. I'll have you show me everything you left within. Apesh. It all makes sense now. <laughs> but now, Rubito, how about we enjoy a moment or two together? Our time has arrived!
Ah, Ruby Doe. You're getting closer to your old self. But you're still not quite there yet. You were much stronger than this back then. Weren't you? Sisters? Look around you. Who is the flower that blooms from those corpses? That's right. It's you, Pesh. Everything is just as Mizrahi, your dear daddy, wanted it to be. Daddy? That's right. Isn't it, Rubido? You bastard. Say any more and you're... You're gonna pay for this! Those girls were toys for your enjoyment. They were all individuals with wills of their own. Yet you... Still spouting that self-righteous crap? Huh? The new guy. Stop screwing around. Hurry up and get the job done. Don't waste your time on these fools. Give him this message. It belongs to me. Hold it! Where do you think you're going? Hey, why don't you do me a favor and let him go for now? I'll do my best to keep you entertained in the meantime.
this is the Y data. I do not exist for your pleasure. You call this protection? didn't want anyone going in there. Oh well, that just makes it all the more interesting. <laughs> Very interesting. Who are you? Who? What does it matter? Or do you need a name to describe me? A definition by words is merely a means to deceive oneself. It's meaningless before the truth. What matters is how you perceive things. The slightest shift, then life and death no longer have any meaning. Huh? You don't get it. Well... How about I show you? Get out of the way! Hmm? I said get out of my way! Ah, you've got guts, boy. Why don't you make me move? Shouldn't be a problem for a URTV. Now should it? You're damn right! It's useless. The laws by which we are governed are just too different. Isn't that right, boss? Well then, I think our friend has already left, and it's about time for me to make my exit. I have a busy schedule to keep. Wait! What are you trying to accomplish? Why did you come here? You want to know? Then come to that time. To that place. You know what I mean. Huh? I'll be waiting for you, Xion. The Song of Nephilim has ceased all functions. The Rhine Maiden is clearing away the remaining Gnosis. I see. Junior, are you all right? Uh, yeah. And you guys? Man, who was that? He had an aura of incredible power. I don't know. I don't understand any of this. Let's go back, Xion. Yeah. <laughs> 